All right, guys. SPC Hanover eight nine four seven here, along with Mrs. Glock. Go ahead, Mrs. Glock. The time is ten o eight. The temperature is sixty four point nine degrees Fahrenheit. The time is ten o eight a.m. The temperature is sixty four point nine degrees Fahrenheit. And today. Yes, it's not a New Year's video yet. Ow. The time this video is being taken, I'm, I'm going to do a New Year's video later. Because the time's going to follow when this video is being taken. So it's about 10.10 10 right now. It's probably about maybe 2 o'clock right now. So anyway, it's uh, Thursday, 10 away on New Year's Eve. The last day of 2020. Oh, yeah. I can't wait for this to, I can't wait for 2020 to go. Anyway, what we're going to do is we're going to look through the stations one more time. Just to see what these radios can get. What was 7 miles per hour? What was 7 miles per hour? Um, so, right now it's cloudy. It's very cloudy outside. Last night when I took did the stations, I did it at dark. When it was nighttime. I did it when it was getting dark, but I didn't do it in complete daylight. So, what we're going to do, we are pretty much going to go ahead and do the same thing. Just see what will happen. Try it. Yep. Since I'm staying up till midnight tonight for the ball drop, hopefully I get to watch that. I probably won't be able to go to sleep until like maybe 3 a.m. Because I don't know. We'll see. Everybody's going to be tired on New Year's Eve because oh, they always are up until midnight watching the ball drop. So, everybody's staying up till midnight tonight. Here we go. Not on cloudy days. This video cannot get anything on cloudy days. Now... Oh, I can't get anything here. Oops. Yeah, I can't do anything. Okay, so basically, the 120 cannot get anything during the daylight hours. So let's see what 300 can do. I know you guys can't see. Oh, there we go. Whoop. Ah! It gets KC Lee 3 pretty good here. I'm going to slide this over. Nice. Uh, can't really get the NQ704 at night. Zero. Forecast 
and it's WX742. Oops. There's the uh, WXK97. I'm somewhat getting WWG52. So, basically. Okay. Okay. So it's it's still pretty good. So pretty much that is a M heaven. So the one twenty here can get only WX no yes WXL forty. And WXM42 on days like these, like cloudy days, when it's over here. We might do another rearrangement today. See what happens. Uh, so, today, pretty much we'll have the radios here. I'll make another day of rearrangement, so that way we'll rearrange something again. Uh, what, 300 over here? We could know that it could get KC83 some, not all the way, because I'd like to have it. As for severe weather on KC83, so that way we can get some warnings on it. So, pretty much if it's KC83, and I'd like to have some warnings on it, the 120, I don't think we'll be able to be on it. I mean, it might be a little bit on it at some point here in the near future, but I don't think so. I think it'll be the 300 on KEC83. And if we do have WXK97 alerts coming in, and sure, I will bring this thing over here for WXK97. But this thing can get KZ83 somewhat from here. It can get WNG704, not really that. Uh, definitely not uh, WNG736, but WXM42 comes in good. It somewhat got uh, WXK97 during the day, which is good, but I think it probably gets, it gets it better at night. WWG52 came in somewhat good, but not really. But, WXL40, KC83, and WXM42, and um, WSK97, so that's pretty good. So, basically, there's the 120 for now, and there's the 300 for now. We'll be doing more re rearrangements. This HH will be next for due for rearrangements. Let's just see what this thing can get. So against KC eighty three is good. Got this got this station though. Now the winter storm watch, what the heck? Okay, well, basically that's it. So these stations do not get, or do not come in as well as daytime, as well as nighttime. So anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed it, and that will be it.